Hello everyone. In this video, Windmill Software will demonstrate how to create project schedules in Clarity PPM. Project schedules, work breakdown structures, or project plans, are lists of tasks that help define the timeline of activities on a project. There are many ways to manage a project schedule in Clarity. Today, I'll focus on creating tasks using the Timeline and Gantt views. Let's begin by looking at the Tasks tab of my project. This is the project timeline view. I can view the work breakdown structure or list of tasks on the left. On the right, I have a timeline view showing the duration and dependencies of my tasks. I can open up the flyout on a task to view all the activity and detailed information. The first tab is for conversations. Here, project managers and team members have a chat area built into the task where they can discuss any progress and blockers to completion. This is a common functionality throughout the solution to simplify collaboration in your organization. I also have a to-do list area where team members or project managers can identify necessary activities within a task. This allows for an extra level of granularity without having to create a task for every detail. I can also see who is assigned to this task and assign more team members as well. I can view the task details and configure additional fields to my flyout. When I need to add a new task, I can click the plus icon to create the task and then drag the task to its place in the WBS. Or I can click within the WBS itself and add the task directly in line as either a sibling or a child task. The timeline area is an interactive schedule where I can push out a task, add to the duration, and create dependencies. Tasks in the timeline are also color-coded based on user preference. In my case, I'm using the task status. I could also choose cost type, that is whether or not it is a capital or operating task. Or I could create a custom set of criteria on my own project. Now let's look at creating tasks in the Clarity Gantt view. This is the out-of-the-box Gantt view in Clarity. Similar to the timeline view, I have a list of tasks on the left and a timeline of tasks on the right. The Gantt initially shows my schedule by phase, but I can expand to show all tasks. To create a new task, click on the check mark icon. This gives two options, manually create new tasks or create tasks using a template. The latter option allows me to copy tasks from a template and place them on my project. For now, I'll opt for the manual create option. This will open a pop-up and I can fill out key information like name, ID, start and finish dates, and more. I can configure this page with custom fields as well to identify other key details when creating a task. When I'm done, I can save the new task, save and create new tasks, which allow me to continue creating a list of tasks, or save and return to go back to my Gantt view. Similar to the timeline view, I can drag and drop the new task to its place in the WBS. I can also update many task related fields in the grid area of the WBS, like start and finish date, ETC, status, percent complete, and more. I have the option to configure additional columns to this view for inline editing. The Gantt view offers a lot of additional functionality that we won't get to in this video, but you can reach out to your Windmill contact to learn more. In this video, we have shown how to create project schedules in Clarity PPN using the Timeline and Gantt views. You can find more videos demonstrating how to perform other functionalities of Clarity PPM on our website.